Hi, in this tutorial, I'm going to discuss software testing lifecycle uh, with VB model, which is verification and validation model. Uh, if you know any other software development lifecycle models like waterfall spiral, then you will notice that this is model which is also called as software testing lifecycle model and the reason this model is preferred for testing lifecycle is because uh, it is very simple and works for complex and medium projects also for small projects where requirements are easily explained and where we want to track each and every module and performance of the resources that we are allocating on project so uh, like so waterfall model there is going to be sequence in v v model 2 each phase here is going to deliver something uh, from which next phase is going to use it for their working so first we are going to gather the requirement and also going to write the test for requirement gathering and after that based on requirements we are going to design a system and there is going to be design specification document on that after that this is going to be a architecture design based on the output of system design specification and based on all of these above we are going to create small modules which are basically form a complete product but before that we are going step by step as a model then write code okay so once we start writing code we are going to test each of these modules using unit testing after that we are going to test these uh, models by connecting them and see if the integration works and after that we are going to complete our product and creating a complete system and also going to test it within the organization with the help of alpha testing team of once that approval comes or you can say the release is ready for use then we are going to go for the acceptance testing and that's where we are going to use a beta tester team which could be third party team outside our organization or a dedicated team which is usually uh, customers or market feedback team and um, in each phase as you can see uh, in system design phase we are building the system and in integration we are readying up our software so this is a rigid model like waterfall uh, but it is easy to use each step is going to deliver you something to build upon uh, there is no clear path here because it is simultaneously tested and also each uh, at each model there could be a problem which is likely to be missed in specification requirement or in coding phase things could go wrong etc and until the coding is done the problems are less likely to be observed but that said uh, you can see small projects medium and bigger projects uh, requirements are easily understood also there is high chance of success because uh, we create test plan and validate our ideas in each of these phases so this is very good model which any software tester should know about so that is pretty much it uh, I will come up with one more video on software testing and we will discuss further about software testing. I will see you later. Bye.